Hello the viewers, especially kids and parents, welcome to Ag Amazing TV. I am Sir Jessica Sman and I will be your teacher in Science 4. Are you ready to explore the enchanting world of science? Now, let's go! Hello kids, Sir Jess here. Tapos na natin i-discuss ang skeletal system. And for today's lesson, ang i-discuss naman natin ay muscular system. Let us now describe how muscle works. Paano kaya nag-work ang ating muscle? Kapag ginahawakan nyo ang katawan nyo, nakakaramdam kayo ng malambot na pakiramdam. Those fleshy parts are called muscles. This is the image of the muscular system. As you can see, ang ating katawan ay nababalutan ng muscles. Some muscles are hard while others are soft. Bones are covered with muscles. Muscles allow us to move, although bones are attached to it. In order to keep the body move, ang mga buto ay hindi gumagalaw kapag wala ang ating muscles. Silang dalawa ay nagtutulungan. All the muscles in the body make up the muscular system. The muscles consist of fiber or muscle cells that are bold together. Some muscles are large while others are long. Some are small while others are short. Muscles make up 40% of the total body weight of a person. Pero paano ba ang muscle ay kumukonekta sa bone? Tingnan mabuti ang muscles na ito na nakadikit sa bone. Itong muscles na ito ay tinatawag na tendon. These are made of top fiber of protein called collagen. When the muscles contract, tendon pulls the bone causing it to move. Muscles. First type, we have the cardiac muscles. It is involuntary muscles present in our heart. It allows the heart to contract rhythmically and continuously. You cannot control or stop the beating of your heart. Second, we have the smooth muscles. They are involuntary muscles which cannot be controlled consciously. These muscles are found in the digestive system. Ito ay kusang gumagalaw sa ating katawan.
Last but not the least, we have the skeletal muscles. These are voluntary muscles that are consciously controlled to move the bone. Siya ang responsible sa lahat ng ating movement. We have arms, legs, chest, and abdomen. Pwede mo silang magalaw kapag ito ay gugustuhin mo. Ang ating body ay mayroong bones and muscles na parehas nagtatrabaho katulong ng ating joints, ligaments, and tendons. Tendons! Tendon is top or that connects muscle to the bones. Ligament. Ligament connects the bones with the other bones. Cartilage is soft and smooth, flexible, bone-like that protects the joints. That ends my discussion. I hope that you will learn something today. Again, this is Sir Jessica Sman saying, Be an explorer, be a discoverer, be an amazing you. This is Agamazing TV.